With the release of ArcGIS Enterprise 1061 and Image Server, we've added a new web app that lets you process drone imagery into useful image products like Orthomosaics and Digital Elevation Models. And this web app is called Orthomaker. You can start Orthomaker from the app's launcher. And here you can see all the projects that you created and you can start a new project. And creating a new project is as easy as adding your drone imagery. <coughs> and then give it some item details. And next you choose a processing template to define what projects you want to create, or you can choose to do it manually after. Let me switch to a project that I did earlier. This is a project with almost 500 drone images I received from Fletcher Construction. And it covers a part of the construction side of a new highway, the Annex 2 project. And after the images are loaded, we see the drone flight path and the location of the images. We can also see the footprints of the images. And you can see there's a lot of overlap. And this overlap is used in the next step of the process where the tie points between the overlapping images are calculated. And this is a, this is a very computation heavy process. And here you can leverage the power of distributed computing of RGS Enterprise by using multiple image server nodes. After this process, you can add ground control points to get even higher accuracy for the products. And in the final step, you can start creating the final products. There are templates for different products available. You can create an auto mosaic, digital elevation model, and also vegetation index and other service models like a hill shape. You can even define your own product using the bands available. You can also go into the settings of the predefined products. The default settings will give you high quality products, but you can also change the settings to your preferences. And after the products are created, you can view them in Automaker. So let's turn off the drone layers and turn on the Auto Mosaic created by Automaker. If you're happy with the outcome, you can share them with your organization from OrderMaker. And because they are web layers, you can use them throughout the platform. For example, here in RGS Pro, we see the same Ortho mosaic, and we're looking at a dirt wall. And the layers that are created are image surfaces. That means that you can use them for analysis. For example, you can use raster functions to do analysis and visualizations on the fly. And I would like to show a couple of examples of that. So this is the Ortho mosaic but I can use a hill shade to make the elevation pop out better. So here I overlaid the hill shade with the order mosaic with some transparency. And next we see an aspect slope visualization and that shows the direction and the steepness of the elevation. And we can also look at the elevation using contour lines. And these contour lines are created on the fly. And as you can see here, I also added two lines and we can use them in charts to view the elevation profile for both lines. And all these layers can be used in the browser as well. And here we look at the scene viewer and we're looking at the full extent of the NX2 project. The drone imagery was captured for the north end of the project and I added the cat design data for the road. And we can see that even better when we zoom in more. We see the cat design and some elevation in the terrain. But the elevation isn't very accurate because a lot has changed here. And we can use the elevation layer to get a more accurate view. As we can see here. And now let's zoom to the dirt wall that we saw in RGS Pro. And we're using the same elevation layer, so we can really see the dirt wall sticking out. And we can also add the contour lines here, that we created in RGS Pro. And if we want to know how high the dirt wall is, we can measure that in the browser as well. So we select the measuring tool, and we click on the top and the bottom of the dirt wall. And now we can see the horizontal reach 
and the height of the dirt wall at this point, which is 6.8 meters. So you can create some amazing products from your drone imagery using OrthoMaker and leverage the distributed computing to do it fast. And you don't have to do it manually either, because with the RGS API for Python, you can automate every step in the process.